Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to another video here on Tahitian County. So it is finally springtime here on the farm and we've got a lot of spring stuff to do. We're going to be getting into a little bit of tree removal, some tillage, maybe a few restoration projects, just all kinds of things today. Well, we better go ahead and get into the video. Well, starting off, we better do some tree removal. So we're going to go cut down some trees at the Blue Shed Farm. And then we got some trees to pick up over in the field just north of the farm here. So let's go ahead and go find a pickup. I'm going to grab the trailer and uh, we're going to load up this skid loader. And then we're going to run over to the Blue Shed Farm and get that done real quick. I think my truck's in the shop. Well, we better look for the trailer because honestly, I have no idea where it is. It's not out here. Not in here. It's not even at the neighbors. I have no idea where it is. Um. Well, we're not going to talk about how I got this trailer. But point is, we got it here, so let's get the skid loader loaded up. All right, and now we're ready to go do some tree removal. All right, so what we got to do is cut down all these trees right in this area. Basically, everything to this creek right here. We've got a lot of big trees, so those are going to be fun. And we've got to pull out this International Ripper and this International Disc. I'll save the Ripper, but I think the Disc is going to get sold. But I'm going to go ahead and hop into Skid Loader here, and we're going to get this done real quick. That took a little bit of time but we got this area cleaned up what i think i'm going to do next is grab the 4440 and we're going to get it hooked up to this disc just get it pulled out of here and uh we'll set it over there because someone bought it and then we're going to get the ripper out of here and then i'll just clean up the rest of these trees We need to get rid of these logs here, so I think I'm going to go grab my flatbed truck, and we're going to get these loaded up. And I got a friend who does firewood, so we're going to take these over there, and maybe he can use them. See if we can't get the truck started. Come on. There we go. Got the truck here, so let's go ahead and get these loaded up real quick.
So I got one load of logs here for my friend, so I'm going to take these to his place, and we're going to load up some other ones over at the main farm. All right, now that we're back at the main farm, we're gonna get these loaded up on the truck and we'll be done with timber. Well, it ain't pretty, but we got them loaded up. I sure hope none of these logs go through the back window. Well, I'm gonna run these over to my friends real quick. Undo the straps. Well, it's all unloaded, so maybe we should head home and possibly do some tillage. And I suppose we better use our 8410. All right, I'm gonna use my John Deere 220 disc. I don't really use it enough, so uh, we're gonna be putting it to work. All right, well, the ground looks a little bit wet, but not bad, so hopefully we don't get stuck. Not really liking the look of this. Come on. She's getting stuck. Well, we're stuck now. Um, let's grab the 8110. Well, I think we should grab the 8110 and a strap. Hopefully we can use that to pull it out. Well, I suppose we better grab a strap. Now hopefully with this tractor I can get the 8410 out of the mud hole. Alright, well we are strapped up, so let's go ahead and try to pull it out of there. Come on. It's struggling. Come on. Well, it moved a little bit, but it's really struggling. It's just spinning out mostly. But I think I got a better idea. I think this should work. Well, I really hope this works. Come on. There we go. It's moving. We got her. Well, I suppose we better get back to tillage. All right, guys. Well, we are done with tillage. So, I think we better work on a restoration project. So, we're going to be heading over to the Blue Shed Farm. So my plan is to restore this John Deere 720 and this John Deere A. But in order to do that, we got to get them out of the shed. We're going to get the forks on the skid loader.
All right, well, we got the A loaded up, and we got the 720 loaded up. Let's strap her down real quick. Gonna run these over to the main farm. All right, guys, so the plan is to get the 720 restored and the A, plus this John Deere manure spreader. The A we're going to be selling, but I'm going to keep the 720, and I'm going to keep the manure spreader. But I'm going to restore these, and then I'll show you guys the finished product. I'd say it's about time we feed the cows. You can hear the cows, they sound pretty hungry. One more bale. Well, that should do her. Got to drive around all these cows. Now, hopefully this spring we can get an early start on hay because, well, I don't really have enough. Oh, hold on a second. Hello? Mm-hmm. All right, sounds good to me. I'll see you in a little bit. Well, guys, looks like I just sold a piece of equipment. Let's go hop in the 1206. So a guy just bought this cultivator for me, and he's going to be coming to pick it up. So we got to get it out of the pasture and get it up to the driveway. Been trying to get rid of a lot of equipment, so this is just going to make it easier. So that worked out pretty well. You can just set it right here. Well, I probably should tell you guys, but I am selling the 8410. So I'm training it off for something newer, but we got to clean this thing up real quick. So they're on their way here with the new tractor, and they're going to be taking the 8410 with them. There we go. It's looking brand new again. Well, they should be here soon. Well, they're here, guys, and there is the new tractor. Well, we better get her unloaded, and I'll get a closer look. All right, well, this is the new purchase. We got a T8 435 Genesis from New Holland. We got duels on the front and the back. We got the three-point. This thing is brand new. And if you look at it compared to the 8410, this thing's a lot bigger. And we're going to be able to do a lot more things with it. Well, I suppose it's a final goodbye for the 8410. Let's get her loaded up on the low boy. Get our chain binders on real quick. Well, I guess now that the 8410 is gone, let's get this TA out in the field and try it out. Well, I tell you what, this thing runs a lot smoother than the 8410. 
Well, the restoration projects are done, so I suppose I better show you guys that. Well, there it is. We got the John Deere 720 all cleaned up. Not just that, we got the John Deere A all cleaned up. And we got the John Deere manure spreader all cleaned up. Now I suppose we better get these things fired up and drive them out of here. Oh yeah. This thing is a beaut. Now question is, will the A start up? Starts right up, no issues. No issues at all. Well, guys, I'd say I'm pretty happy with how these turned out. Dang, that's beautiful. All right, well, this A is going to go to a friend, so he's going to come pick this up. All right, guys, well, I think that's a great place to end this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Be sure to check out the Facebook page and the TikTok. And we will see you all in the next one.